Well, I think we're playing hard. I think we're playing with a lot of enthusiasm, and uh, we got to love that. Uh, uh, still early in the season, a uh, lot of improving to do, but I really like where we're at. Your offense started a little slowly in the game with Lisa, but the defense sure took up the slack there early, didn't Well, I was really proud of them. They kept us in the game in that first quarter, including the defensive touchdown by Sam Gilbreth. And so uh, they played hard, played physical, and just uh, throughout the whole game, really proud of that side of the ball. Well, I thought a bit about Sam in particular. I mean, you know, two interceptions, one return for a touchdown, that's quite a performance. You know, he's such a great kid and a, and a leader for us and uh, works his tail off, uh, overachiever for sure. If you if you saw him out of, pa out of pads, you wouldn't even pick him out as being a football player. but. When the lights come on, he really plays hard. We were excited for him that night. For the third straight game, your offense, I mean, even though you started slowly, you got 51 points. Uh, things are working well on that side of the ball for you. You know, early we were a little bit sloppy, but uh, we refocused at halftime, and I thought that second half we ran the ball well and uh, played a lot more physical and was happy with that. Blake, you really can't put points in a bank or anything. It's a long, long time before you get to district. Just the learning process. I mean, we're just playing. We're just getting better each week. You know, we are, and then every game is a learning experience. Like traveling for two and a half hours. You know, we learned a lot of of how to travel and some areas that we need to do better. And so we're taking all these experiences and, and hoping that they pay off in district. Do you think the slow start has something to do with just the distance that you had to travel and just kind of getting out those nerves on your first road trip? You know, we talked about that. We we had a conversation about that at halftime a little bit. Um, just means that I need to do a better job of getting us focused and doing a better job leading up to the game, and, and I'll try to take care of that. Um, we kind of knew before the season started how good your guys' offense could be, the potential it had, but we didn't really know about this defense. Do you think just how well they've been playing lately, how this can just kind of raise the potential of the whole team this season? I think so. I think. Uh, Cage, one of our uh, great defensive players over there. And the first thing he'd probably tell you is our new defensive coordinator, Coach Anderson, is, is amazing. The energy that he brings, and uh, kids love him and love playing for him, as well as our whole defensive staff. And we're, you know, we're three games into a brand new defense, and so we're still learning a lot, and we're still getting challenged in some areas, but I, I like where we're at right now. Um, can you just kind of preview the matchup coming up this Friday? Yeah, Caprock's a very good football team defensively. Uh, they run a 3-4 front like us, except they're a lot more aggressive with it. Uh, bring somebody about every snap, play straight man-to-man. -man. Uh, you're going to have to do a good job picking up their blitzes and, and beating one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, offensively, they're multiple. Uh, they, they're a little bit different now that they have the other quarterback in. They're throwing a little bit more, but they'll get in everything from empty to two tight ends. And so first, you've got to line up correctly. And then after that, you just got to really play well and tackle well. Blake, you explained to your defense that the defense is the team who scores the points because they get the, they, they get off the field, get the offense back on the field, and that's how you score points in the <coughs> offense. You don't score points with the defense on the field. Right. But you've got to get that offense on the field. Yeah, they and, and our our kids do a great job of that, and we have a a deal that we're doing and making a big deal even during practice where we have a third down. We'll. we'll uh, we have we call it a money down so that we can get ourselves off the field. We have a signal that reminds us that it's third down. We even have our band playing the money, money, money song on third down. So it, we do some neat things right there, and our defense is kind of inspired by that.